Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in today's video. So, we are getting near to February, which is the month of, you know, Valentine's Day. So, I want to do a video on what scents I think would be good to wear for Valentine's Day. Um, so, I have one... I have like 10 cents, so, and I have nine in front of me, and then I have another one that I'm going to have to show you guys, but the first one I think would be really nice to wear on Valentine's Day is You're the One. The notes on this is White Birch Velvety Rose Drop of Strawberry Nectar. Um, I am going to say this is very strong and very, very perfumey. Like, this is like a high-end type of scent, so... If you get headaches very easily, I would not recommend wearing this because this is going to pretty much, I would say, give you a headache. And that's why I never really wear this because it's just too much for me personally. But this one would be nice to wear on Valentine's Day or something. So not a bad pick. All right. Then the next one is Strawberry Pound Cake. And this is a scent I think I'm going to be wearing on Valentine's Day because I really love this scent. So the notes on this is fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. So this scent to me is it's a bakery scent. It's very, it's very good. It's like a it's like a strawberry whipped cream type of scent. And this one's really nice for Valentine's Day. Like I said, I think this is the one I'm going to be wearing because this one is really, really nice. So, and I just dropped it one second. Anyway, as I was saying, I think this scent would be a really good scent for Valentine's Day. Like I said, this is probably going to be the scent I end up wearing, but yeah. All right, next up, okay, we got this is some good ones. Raspberry Jam Donut. This is Wild Raspberry Jam Powdered Sugar Warm Fluffy Donut. So, this scent is really good to wear for Valentine's Day. I recommend it. I'm not going to be wearing this one for Valentine's Day, but um, this is one that I recommend. It's really good. So, basically... This scent it smells like a raspberry jam donut. It really does. This is a very gourmand scent. And honestly, if you don't like raspberries, you're still gonna like this scent. Um, because I don't really like raspberry scents too much. I still like it. It's more of that warm, fluffy donut that you get. And then you get, you know, like the warm, fluffy donut is almost like the base. And then you add like the raspberry jam sprinkled off with a little bit of that powdered sugar. That's kind of how this scent is to me. And I really like this one. I really think this one would be really nice for Valentine's Day. So this one's good. Next up, another one I think would be really nice is Chocolate Covered Cherry. This is another one that's, like, really good for Valentine's Day. Notes on this is milk, uh, rich milk chocolate, red cherries, and, like, I think this is sweet liqueur. Yeah. And this scent is so good, guys. I mean, this reminds me, and I know... I. This reminds me of like a wine, like the way I don't. I just sprayed it, and that's what this reminds me of. But I don't know why this smells like wine to me, guys. I mean, I don't know why. I, I think my, my nose is just changing because for some reason it smells like wine to me. Okay, no. -uh. So when you first spray it, it kind of smells like wine. But actually, the more when it like in your, soaks into your skin, it you get the chocolate. You get more of that chocolate cherry scent. Um, but 
so weird. I don't know why. I'm like, but yeah, this is decent, but I don't know. I feel like, I don't know. I'm not like the biggest fan. I feel like this one maybe, I don't know. I guess this is not one of my top picks for Valentine's. I mean, it is, but not one I would want to really, really, really wear. But it's not a bad scent though. Like, it's really not. So this is, I. it's good. I recommend it. I mean, it's, it's something different. Like, I don't know. Sounds decent. All right, next up. This is one I'm, this is another one I really wanted to wear for Valentine's Day. Love Cotton Candy Champagne. This was a scent that was just out for Christmas or winter. And this one's nice. This is uh, Bubbly Rose, Sweet Strawberry, Pink Sugar. This is like a nice sugary scent. That's exactly how I like to explain or describe this scent. It's great. It's just a sweet sugary scent with like strawberry sugar. Like that's why I picture it, like strawberry sugar. That's what this smells like. It's so good. And speaking of the next one, that's they're almost like, this one's so good. Um. This one's nice. So next up, we actually have strawberry soda. So this is fresh strawberry, bubbly seltzer, and crushed ice. So the difference between these two, because I know I just said that this one was like a, like a strawberry sugar scent, and this is basically like the same thing. No, -uh, they're different. Mm -mm. This one has more of the element of like that a bubbly, you know, drink type of vibe. And this one has more on true strawberry. This is more, uh, you get the bubbly rosé, the pink strawberry. So this is more added stuff where this is more like, okay, straight on strawberry scent. Um, like a true on strawberry. This is another row, really good scent though. And I do recommend it. So, got those. Next up, oh my God, I love this one. Champagne sprinkles right up my alley. Sparkling champagne, raspberry icing, rainbow sprinkles. Oh gosh, guys, I love this one. Oh my gosh. This one, I, I love this one. Uh, but to me, this, again, kind of in the same category with the last two I shared with you guys. It really is in the same category. And what I'm getting from this scent, I'm getting, I think I, I, I'm mainly getting from this scent of like, I'm getting a lot of that raspberry icing, that sparkling champagne. I mean, rainbow sprinkles, you can't really smell rainbow sprinkles. Maybe it just adds like a, I don't know. Um, but I'm mainly getting, again, the champagne and the raspberry icing in this. And this one is life. Like, I love this one. This one would also be an actually another one, good one for, like, New Year's. I know it just passed, but something to think about for next year. Next up, we have the Whipped Rose Latte. Crushed, ro crushed Rose Petals Cocoa Flower Whipped Foam. So, this one I was physically thinking about maybe for Valentine's Day. Let's say you were going to get coffee. This one would be a really good one, you know, to spray on in the morning to go get, um, like, coffee and kind of, like, just as, like, a relaxed morning scent, you know? And then, and to me, what this smells like, by the way, I'm, like, spraying so many scents. I don't even have room. It's kind of hard to get a good read. Um, I don't really have any more room on myself, so I'm, like, spraying. Okay, so, like, to me, cocoa flower is just, like, the coffee. So, I'm getting rose and coffee, and this smells really good. Like I said, this is, I picture someone wearing this more in kind of, like, the um, morning of maybe they're going out for some coffee, and then later at nighttime, maybe you put on some pure wonder. This is Ice Rose, Star Jasmine, White Warm Amber. This one, 
I feel like is gonna be right up so many people's alleys. And let me tell you why. Um, because the first one I shared, you're the one. I said a headache inducing, highly strong, highly like perfumey, highly like expensive vibes, but I'm gonna tell you, I'm not a huge fan of this just because it's kind of, it is headache inducing. But this one is perfumey, but it's so much better. I mean, it's less headache inducing. It's more sweet, like more my type. It's like perfumey and sweet. And it's not headache inducing for me. And this is the scent again. This one literally just came out. I am obsessed with it. I love it. I think it's really good. But this is not one again. It's on an everyday scent. But for Valentine's Day, this is pretty good. So the last that I wanted to share with you guys is actually out right now. So if you guys want to go snag it um, or want to get it, I recommend it. Sorry, I'm not trying to be rude and be on my phone right now. But I wanted to show you guys the scent because I don't own it. Gingham, oh, woo, this lighting, come on, please work. Gingham Love, it's a new fragrance and it's Gingham Love. And the note, the notes, the fine, the notes to this is um, sugared red berries, blushing freesia, and rose meringue. So there you go. So that's it for today's video um like i said i just wanted to give you guys some scents that i recommend to wear for valentine's day and um since we were entering the month of february and stuff i wanted to do that video for you guys so make sure to like subscribe turn on post notifications so you guys can stay updated every time we post a new video bye guys